नमस्ते दिस इज डॉक्टर के जे रेड्डी ऑर्थोपेडिक सर्जन अपोलो हॉस्पिटल्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट ऑस्टियो ऑर्थराइटिस स्पेशली ऑफ द नी जॉइंट विच इज वेरी कॉमन एंड इज एफेक्टिंग नियरली सेवन क्रोर पॉपुलेशन इन इंडिया वॉट इज ऑस्टियो ऑर्थराइटिस ऑस्टियो ऑर्थराइटिस इज नथिंग बट वेर एंड टेयर ऑफ ए जॉइंट एंड इट मेनली एफेक्ट्स मेजर जॉइंट्स लाइक नी जॉइंट हिप जॉइंट एंड जॉइंट्स ऑफ द आर्म basically what happens is the end of the bone forms the joint it is covered by the cartilage the cartilage gets wear and tear and it doesn't get repaired so the bone under the cartilage gets exposed which becomes painful what is cartilage cartilage is most important part of the joint it covers end of the bone where it forms joint with the other bone it is avascular that means it does not have any blood supply does not have any nerve supply so any damage to the cartilage is not repairable so it's very important to protect the cartilage so that it won't get damaged permanently otherwise it will lead to osteoarthritis who is affected by osteoarthritis anybody can be affected by osteoarthritis but mainly middle aged and elderly people gets affected by osteoarthritis especially after age of 40 50 because wear and tear every person have the ability to repair some level of injury to the cartilage if this repair is not done or is broken down in osteoarthritis and that leads to arthritis which we which will become painful what are the risk factors for osteoarthritis the exact cause of osteoarthritis is not known but we know what exactly happens in osteoarthritis that means the normal repair mechanism of the cartilage due to day to day activities is lost in osteoarthritis but some of the risk factors are it runs in families some are more prone for osteoarthritis that means if their grandparents or great grandparents are affected it's likely their children grandchildren might be affected people who have weak muscles are affected and also joints affected in the past by injuries by infection by other means where the cartilage is damaged like systemic diseases affecting the health of the cartilage will also be leading to osteoarthritis this this is called secondary osteoarthritis due to primary problem which may be as i said injury infection or systemic infections what are the causes and symptoms of osteoarthritis the exact cause of osteoarthritis is not known but it runs a family and most of the time it is wear and tear disease so the normal mechanism of cartilage repair is lost it runs in families and it also affects people who do not have strong muscles who have sedentary lifestyle and who joints are affected in the past by injuries which are not treated or infections or conditions where like in uh, uric acid high levels which will lead to gout the crystals get deposited in the joint and the cartilage gets damaged leading to osteoarthritis and the symptoms of arthritis are are main symptom is pain initially the pain will be in 
heavy physical activity. Later, it will lead to normal physical activity. And this pain can lead to rest pain and pain disturbing sleep. This is the most important symptom. Pain is associated with swelling and sometimes if severe, it leads to deformity, difficulty in walking, especially climbing stairs, difficulty on sitting on the floor. How is osteoarthritis treated? The osteoarthritis is treated based on the stage of osteoarthritis. There are four stages of osteoarthritis. Stage 1 is mild, stage 2 is mild to moderate, stage 3 is moderate to severe, stage 4 is severe osteoarthritis. Stage 1 and 2, 90% of them are treated non-operatively with a simple modification of their activities physiotherapy and simple painkillers like paracetamol. In stage 2 and 3, sometimes we inject fluid, that means joint fluid into the joint, which is low or not healthy in the knee joints. It helps. Also, we treat with the PRP, that's a stem cells or platelet-rich plasma injection into the knee joint which might improve the quality of the cartilage, also might help to improve the repair of the cartilage. In stage 3, where there is swelling of the joint, there is fluid in the joint, there may be loose bodies, this condition can be treated with arthroscopic surgery. That's a keyhole surgery, where we put endoscope or arthroscope into the knee joint, and use laser equipment to remove the loose bodies or remove the debris in the joint and remove the fluid which will relieve symptoms. In stage 4, which is a severe osteoarthritis, that means you have pain on walking, pain on rest and pain at night. That means your quality of life is affected. You are you are experience pain all the time. Nowadays, there is a remedy in the past, maybe 30, 40 years ago, these people used to suffer and used to die with uh, severe osteoarthritis. Now, as most of you know, knee replacement is the solution. And the total knee replacement has changed the way we look at this condition in modern orthopedics. It has revolutionized the treatment. If it is done in the right patient, it is very successful. So now we discussed about osteoarthritis, which is a very common problem. As you realized, osteoarthritis is treated non-operatively in 90% of the patients. Only 10% of the patients need surgical procedure. And we have a great solution for uh, those who need surgery, especially knee replacement. As I said, those who have severe symptoms affecting their quality of life should see their doctor and probably take treatment if it requires a knee replacement. Nowadays, we do fast track knee replacement, which is less painful, fast recovery. We send you home on the same day or following day. Stay safe, stay healthy, Stay well informed. Namaste.